He made her the tennis court? Ding, 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 ding. Thank you. Oh, you got her right. <laughs> Congratulations. A pop quiz, an attempt at voice acting, and a panel discussion. These Chinese and American youths are growing closer through fun activities. I hope the young people get their creative juices flowing <laughs> and do something fun. You know, it's fun to, to have friends in another culture. I think communication is always like the, the reason why we progress as a humanity. For young people to go to the U.S. and young people from the U.S. to come to China to understand and to talk with local people is actually a great way of promoting the relationship in general. In a key part of the youth exchange program, the young Chinese and Americans witnessed the global release of a radio drama series Echoes of Ku Liang. The radio drama presents a story of friendship between a Chinese and an American family in Ku Liang, Fuzhou, over the past century. The American descendants of the Ku Liang community tell their stories with the younger generation, and together they share their vision for stronger ties between two peoples across the Pacific. Friendship is forever in that if you share your, your love, not just with you, but with the community and with the country, you're making an influence that does indeed last forever. During their week-long stay in Fuzhou, the young Americans also go on a scavenger hunt, plant friendship trees and attend a youth bazaar side by side with their Chinese counterparts. The future of China-U.S. relations lies in the younger generation. So this is why we put together such a big event for young people of both countries, you know, to join in. This is our biggest hope, and uh, we will do our utmost with our partners in both countries, you know, to realize this goal. Yeah. Starting from this year, Chinese people expect to receive and befriend 50,000 American youths in five years and enhance the basis for people-to-people -people exchanges between China and the U.S. for years to come. Liu Yushan, CGTN, Fuzhou.